Trivan, with its fin-like ridge, is one of the most recognisable mountains in the United Kingdom. This captivating place has become a mecca for scramblers and climbers, but look beyond the hype and the flashy social media posts and all is not well. Thousands of people summit this peak every year and at 918 metres it's the 15th highest mountain in Wales. But the height of Trivan isn't what pulls visitors here. It's this. Trivan's challenging ridges, towers, buttresses and gullies are all within a short distance of the nearby road and are absolutely loved by mountaineers who travel the country to visit this place. Trivan has become a haven for scramblers and walkers who want to try something more challenging and also climbers who test themselves on some of the finest rock in the country. So what's gone wrong? Each marker you see on this page represents a mountain rescue call out in 2023. There were over 40 incidents on Trivan alone. If we look at the wider area, which still doesn't include the popular Snowdon mountain range, Ogwin Valley Mountain Rescue were called out a staggering 173 times. That's nearly once every two days for the entire year. On the incident report page, which I encourage you to look at, I found everything from walkers with cramp and those that were lost to fatalities and serious injuries that required a helicopter rescue. Only a couple of months ago, a young, fit and healthy 19-year-old man lost his life trying to descend the north ridge of Trevan. He and his group became lost above the dangerous Waigully area. This is only three weeks after another group of people became lost above the same Waigully area and had to be rescued. Fast forward a month and there was another fatality, this time on the easier South Ridge route. These people weren't climbers with rope and harnesses, just regular walkers, hikers and scramblers who went out for a trek. Trevan is not a mountain that you can walk up. At best, it's a scrambling route and at its most severe, it's dangerous climbing terrain. If you've never been up Trevan before and are thinking about making your first ascent, consider these things first. At number one, consider hiring one of the many qualified mountain leaders based in Snowdonia who can take you up here either on a one-to-one -one basis or part of a larger group. This is a great way to meet like-minded people and stay safe at the same time. I often see guided groups on Trevan and there's no shame in getting a pro to show you what the terrain is like. Number two, despite the recent incident on the South Ridge, uh, this route is subject to far fewer mountain rescue callouts each year, with only four in 2023, and one of those was on the summit. This compares to over 30 callouts on the North Ridge. The South Ridge route is widely considered easier than the challenge in North Ridge and is around half the length as well. As you can see from this footage of the South Ridge, it really is a fantastic route with stunning views and well worth the effort. And number three, do your research into the North Tower, which is the hardest section of the North Ridge route and the place where many scramblers realize they are in over their heads. I've already published a short video about the North Tower and I'll place a link to that in the video description. As you can see from this footage, this is not easy walking terrain and you'll need to use your hands to scramble and climb over the rocks here. The North Tower location has seen mountain rescue call outs for panic attacks, dog walkers getting lost while trying to go around the side of the tower and those that have slipped and fallen. Number four is my final tip. Be aware that this mountain has a fin-like ridge and in descent, scramblers should stay on the ridge line rather than trying to descend randomly down one of the gullies off the east or west side. As you can see from my footage, the east side is hopelessly steep and rope will almost certainly be required here. The west side is even worse as this is the shaded side and is often damp and slippery. Many of the mountain rescue callouts on the north ridge are due to scramblers getting lost while trying to descend. This really isn't the place for beginners to get lost. I hope I haven't put you off exploring this incredible mountain that is loved by scramblers and climbers. On Trevan, you'll find an abundance of rocky gullies, sharp ridges and blocky buttresses to explore. And the vast majority of people who come here do so without incident. 
Just be aware of the dangers, plan your trek accordingly and respect the mountain so you don't become another statistic. If you've enjoyed this video from me, subscribe to my channel to see more of my content in the future. Stay safe and all the best.